Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Thomas and Friends. This one is called The Great Unveiling by Sir Topham Hatt. He has a big surprise for everyone here today, and he invited some of his friends, some of the best trains, to come and watch The Mystery is Under This Green Tarp. And they can't wait to pull it off to see what's underneath it. Of course, absent from this here event is off in the distance, hidden in the clock tower. You can almost see the eyes of, that's right, it's Diesel 10. And he's not invited to the event. But will he screw it up? That's the question. Sir so Topham Hat gathered everyone around and was ready to pull the string to show everybody what was here. It's the new aquarium. The Sodor Aquarium. They were all wondering when it was going to arrive and it arrived today. Well, this is, a, this is the Sodor Aquarium. It's a standalone item. It's got a little, um, some water inside and some fish and if you turn this right handle it kind of goes around, the fish go around. It's kind of expensive. We got this on eBay and because we didn't want the set. All we got was just the uh, aquarium itself. And we had previously got um, the aquarium cars. This is one aquarium car here. And there's the other one. One has, it looks like a pink octopus or a squid or something. And it might be a fish. This has a white fish. It could be a shark. Who knows what it is. But anyway, they go on the track and they travel around. And uh, they're part of the set today. So while they're all here celebrating the arrival of the nice aquarium play set, Diesel 10 is plotting his revenge as usual. So that night, when all the cars were asleep, Diesel Ken came out of the clock tower. Both of the aquarium cars were sitting next to the aquarium, and that was his chance. And off he went. Diesel 10 took them all the way down to the docks. Where was he taking them? Who knows? But he knew what he was doing. Yes! He gets his revenge. He put both aquarium cars into the water. And takes off. The next day, Sir Topham Hat surveys the damage and says, How did they get here? Did you see anything, Cranky? No, not a word, says Cranky. I was asleep. Well, we all know who did it, they said. It had to be Diesel 10. No problem, Sir Topham had said. We can get them out of there. Okay, Cranky, do your thing. So Cranky pulled one aquarium car out of the water and put it back on the track. Then he got the next one. Careful. It's a big train. That's it. And before you know it, both aquarium cars are back on track. And before you know it, things are all back to normal. And they have to get Diesel 10 now for what he did. Thanks for watching, guys. Tune in for another chapter someday. Hope you enjoyed that. Please leave a comment. Hello, Bullstrode. How are you?